Hi, I'm Sue Ann. As an ex-professional athlete, I've experienced some serious wear and tear in areas such as my wrist, my shoulders, and my knees. But today we'll be discussing about some of the most common knee problems. And to help me with that, we have an expert from Glen Eagles Hospital, Dr. Sean Ng, an orthopedic surgeon, to answer all your questions. Okay, thank you Dr. Ng for being here. We really appreciate your time. You. Uh, let's kick off this discussion uh, about clicking and grinding of the knees, which okay. I find uh, happens to me personally very mm -hmm. often, but also to a lot of people. Yes. Now, my question to you, is this going to lead to potential problems in the future such as arthritis? Okay, clicking of the knees is actually a very common complaint, but what is more important if there's any associated pain within the knee, if it's just normal clicking when you're walking, when you're bending or when you're coming up from a squatting position, it's fine to just observe. But when the patient starts to complain of discomfort or pain, and then we start to think of more serious problems, for example, wearing out of the cartilage, or even more complicated problems like arthritis in future. Actually, when the pain starts to develop, it means it's the body, body's way of telling you that the cartilage is starting to wear out. It gets thinner and thinner. And if it comes to a stage when the cartilage is worn off completely, then what you would get would be sometimes bone rubbing onto bone. And that is painful. Okay. What are some of the most common knee injuries you see in a sports person, be it amateur or professional? There are many potential problems in the knee that can happen in the athlete. One of the more common complaints or problems would be an anterior knee pain syndrome where the patient complains of knee pain on the front of the knee it's normally from an overuse problem they tend to overwork their knees and they experience knee pain after that the more serious injuries within the knee that can happen would be ligamentous or meniscal injuries for example in this model of the knee over here where the black line is that's the anterior cruciate ligament it's a career-ending injury for many athletes and it's the, the strongest ligament in, in the knee to support the knee. Other injuries would be the meniscus, which is this C-shaped ring here on the inside and on the outside of the knee. These are shock absorbers of the knee and they tend to get damaged too in injuries. All right, well, to wrap this up, Dr. Ng, um, final question sure. would be, what would be the best advice you can give uh, for people who just want to start exercising? Okay, the best piece of advice that I can I would want to say would be to know your limits. You know, if you want to start exercising again, be sure to know how much your body can take. If there's any pain or discomfort in any part of your body, and for example, the knees, and if the pain is persistent, please go and see someone, see a doctor to make sure there's no more severe underlying injury. And if everything is okay and the all clear is given, please go ahead and do within your best limits. Well, thank you so much for being here. We really appreciate all the advice. So thank you so much. Thank you very much. Yes. I hope you picked up some helpful tips from Dr. Sean Ng. Watch out for more videos on sports health brought to you by Glen Eagles Hospital.